Hello guys and welcome to The Walking Dead. This is your host, Walkfeast, and today we're going to do episode 2. Yay, stuff for help. So, without further ado, let's begin. 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 There we are. It's just loading. So yeah, if I haven't seen them for once, I do recommend you watch them. On the walking dead. I know who you are. Oh, I got a really good one for you. <laughs> You've been all by yourself through this? Yeah, I want my parents to come home now. And you, you keep an eye on that front door. You're our lookout. It's Doug. You got it. And I'm Carly. Okay, Carly, you'll shift in with Doug when- You got it, boss. <laughs> Son of a bitch. One of them is bitten. We reason with him. With the bloody end of an axe handle, maybe. Nobody threatens my boy. give a shit about what happens to you, but if anything happens to my daughter or that little girl you've got with you, <laughs> you watch your ass. And that's what happened last time. <laughs> I was going to explain at the beginning, but I need to. So, yes, I know. Step aside. So, yeah. Um, yeah. <laughs> Man, tell tell means person this game. <laughs> there we are. You can buy. Three months later. And <laughs> well, it's under, I must say. Damn it. What'd they get this time? Uh, looks like a rabbit. Oh, that's a <sighs> rabbit. Well, that's another meal lost. <sighs> I still can't believe we went through all that commissary food in three months. It seemed like so much at the time. Damn. Maybe you shouldn't have opened the door. Yeah, except then I'd probably be food by now. Trust me, I have no regrets. Uh, rabbit's okay. hardly a meal, Mark, but I'd take it. We're all hungry. No kidding. When I accidentally grabbed for Carly's rations the other night, I thought she was going to take off my hand. <laughs> We're all on edge. Just cut us some slack. Yeah, don't cut her. Cut yeah, her. you're right. I wish I knew for sure how much food we have left. Um, uh, yeah, you He'll have to ask Lily. She's the one handling the rations. Or mishandling it, if you ask Kenny. He's just worried about his kid getting enough. I worry about Clementine, yeah. too. <laughs> You think Kenny's having any more luck than we are out here? I sure hope so. Case of the future. Yeah, between the lack of food and Kenny and Lily fighting all the time, things are getting pretty tense back at the motor inn. You know, Kenny's been talking about taking off if he can get that RV running. Ooh, let's see. Maybe he'll be better off without us. We'll have Oops, that's the one going. I mean, trust that. I want to keep it And one fewer gun hand. One way or the other, it's a bad situation. Can't blame him, though. Did you hear Larry he going off him? on him last night? What's the old guy's deal, anyway? Seems like he's got a problem with you in particular. I wasn't listening. What do you say? Um, <laughs> uh, yeah, he's looking out for his daughter. Looking out for his daughter. Hey, I know Lily. She can take care of herself. He needs to take that energy and put it towards finding us some more food. And I know Lily thinks he's getting weaker, but the guy's all muscle. He's a walking pile driver. I know I wouldn't want to be stuck in a room with him. And didn't he Damn. punch you in the face one time? Uh, knock me flat. <laughs> because you wasn't expecting it. Oh, bird, shoot it. Okay, 
a long shot. I'd hate to waste the bullets. Trust me. If I don't think I can hit it, I won't shoot. This is a white boy. You may hit it. You missed, you bastard. Shit! Ooh, was that Kenny? Shot, I don't know. Come on! Come on, let's go. Jesus Christ. Oh shit, no, no, please don't kill us. We just want to help our teacher, we'll leave, I swear. Lee, you guys okay? Get, get it off, get it off, God damn it! Get, get it off me. Uh, Travis, maybe they can help. These might be the same guys that raided our camp and we barely got away from that. What no, no. Why the fuck is there a bear trap out here? It's okay, yeah, we're not no. gonna hurt you. Don't listen to them, Ben. Please, just let us go. We're not a threat to you. Kid, chill out. We'll try to help you, but you gotta shut the fuck up. Please, this is fucked up. You gotta help. Please. Yes. Oh, Ben, shut up. My dad was special forces. I know what I'm doing. Just see if you can get him out. After that, you can leave us or whatever. I don't care. Please. We gotta get him out of there. Oh, God, thank you. Fine, but you gotta hurry. Yes, oh, yeah, zombies are coming. Hurry, please, hurry. See somebody just there. What did I say? Lee, this trap has been altered. There's no release latch. Oh no. Yes, somebody is really. Shit! Walkers! It's now or never, Lee! Please! Get me out of this! Mark, get the boys back! Kenny, keep those walkers off of me! There's gotta be something! Okay, hack his neck off. Do something! No, no, no! Try the trap again! Anything, please! And even try the trap. Come on, try go. Ah! Oh. Ah! Oh. Ah! Oh. Let's go, let's go! There's one more here. Ah! 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 Lee, it has to be now! Oh, uh, oh shit. Is he? He passed out. Yep. At least he's alive. He's alive. Grab him and let's go. Yes. Let's go. Hold hands on him. Let's go. Behind you, Travis. Come on, come on, we gotta move! Clementine kicking a ball. How did that ball come back? That was a bit of a time. How is that ball coming back? It's a magic ball. Clementine, shut up, you're attracting zombies. Clementine. Yeah, thank you. Get the guy. 
Gates open! We've got wounded! Shit! What the hell are they doing? We are saving people. Come on! Come on! Oh my god! What happened? Oh, what's going on? Don't have time to explain. Lee, are you okay? Get him into the truck. I'll Let's see what I can do. Cat, okay? can you fix him? Jesus, Ken! Lee! I, I don't know! Lee! What yes, the me. hell? You can't just be bringing new people here. What are you thinking? Hey, you want to calm down yes, for I a fucking hey, minute? What's no, I don't! I want to know why you thought bringing more mouths to feed was a good idea. I thought we could save his life. I'm the one that took his leg. That makes me responsible. Well, yes, that does. was a stupid thing to do. We are not responsible for every struggling survivor we come across. We have to focus on our group, right here, right now. Well, hang yes. on. We haven't even talked to these people yet. Maybe they can be helpful. Come on, Lily. These are people. People trying to survive just like us. We've got to stick together to survive. The yes, only reason do. you're here is because you had food. Enough for all of us. But that food is almost gone. We've got maybe a week's worth left. Mm. And I don't suppose you guys are carrying any groceries, are you? Um, no. Fine, you guys fight it out then. <sighs> Welcome to the family, kid. Come yeah. over here and Wait. see what I drew. Wait, what? No, I... Just come on, okay? You know, you like to think you're the leader of this little group, but yeah. we can make our own goddamn decisions. This, no, this isn't me. your own personal dictatorship. Oh, come on, you're being dramatic. Everything always turns into a power struggle between you two. I'm not gonna be a part of that. Hey, I didn't ask to lead this group. Everyone was happy to have me distributing the food when there was enough to go around, but now that it's running out, suddenly I'm a goddamn Nazi. It doesn't matter who's in charge. Those no, people are dead. here now. I guess we just have to decide what happens No, next. Lee, it does no, matter. One person can't be in charge of everything. You know, it might feel safe for you to sit on the fence, but sooner or later you're gonna have to decide whose side you're on. I don't I see like any of you stepping up to no. make the hard decisions. My girl's got more balls than all of you combined. Dad, please. Why That's don't you go help Mark with the wall? Bye. <laughs> yeah, fixed wall. You think this is easy for me? Everyone's starting to nope. hate me because I'm the one that rations the food. But nobody else wants to. You do it. It's kind of fair. You know what? I'm not doing what? it tonight. You do it. There's today's food rations, but there's not enough for everyone. Good luck. Only why give it to me? Why me? Oh, good. No. Four items. And I've got to, got to give it to all of them. I know what to do. If you know those cheese things, the cheese and stick things, give one everyone one of them. Well, yeah, give one them, then cut that one into quarters and you'll be fine. Is he gonna be okay? I don't know. Can you give me a hand real quick? Of course. Sure. What do you need? Just apply some pressure here while I try to close this up. You know, I thought I was starting to get used to this, sewing up people's injuries. But I mean, cuts and bruises are one thing, but Lee, this man has no leg. Correct. I did the right thing. Yeah, I know you did. The right thing is just scary sometimes, I guess. That is true. Well, you've done all you can, Lee. Thanks for the help. Go ahead and check in on the others. I need a little space here anyway. Okay. <clears throat> I guess you don't need any food. And I got a cookie and a cookie and a apple and a thing. Right, whoa, 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 what's happening? Go back. How you doing, Clementine? Okay. Where's your hat? I don't know. Can you help me find it? You lost your hat? How could you lose your hat? Sure. When did you lose it? I had it a couple days ago. I promise. If I find it, I'll let you know. Thank you. Okay, Clem. I've got you to take care of some things. How could you lose your Why don't you go hat? back to playing with Duck for a while? Okay. Well, I got another plan if I could. 
So I give kids food. I don't know, he's a teenager. Um, who said I give the food? Football! At least the kids have something to keep them occupied. Okay, soccer board. Same thing. Will you hold the damn board steady? I'm trying. I, I didn't realize I was getting this weak already. What do you want? A handout? Oh, I got 60 cents in my pocket. If you'll shut up and quit being such a pansy. Hmm. Gonna talk to him if he needs help. Lily thinks we should throw Get these down. new people out. Damn right! There's too many people hanging around here as it is. Throw some food? Yeah, I... I don't need to give him food or... Nah, quit. Need Get... any help with the wall? Nope. Actually, we could use your axe. Nope. <laughs> Do you mind if we take it? Yeah, give us that thing for a bit. Oh, he's a bit commanding. Um... Mark or Lenny? Give Here, to Lenny because this should he's help. Try not to make good. too much noise. Though. Yeah, yeah, we're not stupid. Come on, Larry. Cut Lee some slack. He knows you're just yeah. out to protect Lily. He told me so. Just like he's trying to protect Clementine. He and everyone <laughs> else. Oh, I just need some food. Going this long without a proper meal make anybody cranky. You need food? Well, I can give <sighs> you some. Here, Larry. Give Atto Joe Beef. Well, he would want you to keep your strength. Up. That girl needs to quit worrying about me so much. You said you need food. Oh man. Just seeing the food is driving me crazy. Well, you can have some food as well. Here, eat something. Do an apple? I'll give you an apple. You got you an apple. Wow. Thanks a lot. That's that's awesome. Yes, it is. Um, so I give the food to the kids, or I want to give it to the nuba. You look hungry. This, I'm looking after all. He's a bit mad in the head. Talk to all of them. Lenny's my friend, so. I could... Sleeping any better? No. I know we should be grateful for beds, but no, I'm not. Oh. Drugstore. Yeah. Uh, Back in it. a bit. I'm gonna talk to Lenny. Lenny. Yeah, Lenny. Let's go. Word's getting out that you want to leave the motor in. That ain't no secret, Lee. It's probably our best bet. What the hell are you holding? Look, you've been good to me and my family. You saved Duck from those monsters, and you stood up to Larry Zombies. at the drugstore. I won't forget that. You and Clem are welcome to come with us. Really? I would like to come. Sounds like a smart idea. Coast does sound like a smart idea. Maybe that is the best thing. I know that it is. I'm taking my family. Taking your family and me, Clementine? Oh, it's a... It's a pipe. Possibly for the radiator coolant or the exhaust. It won't be exhaust because it's water. Hmm. Do I talk? I'm gonna to talk to you. Hey, is my friend gonna make it? I don't of know. course he is. Kaja will do her best. No, he's not. I promise. I can't believe you chopped off his leg. There was no other way. That's true. So, who are you? Yeah, so who, are, who you? are you people? Our group's gonna want to know. I'm Ben. Ben Paul. The man you saved is Mr. Parker, the band director at my school. We all came down from Stone Mountain for the playoffs when... when everything happened. Oh, okay. How are you, you holding know? up, kid? Uh, well, I, uh... I keep wondering if I could have done something to help, you know? Some kind of... I don't know. Something. Uh, He'll be prepared next time. Yes, you will. Next time? Yeah. Relax. Yeah. 
Not we'll get your friend back to normal in no time. I sure hope so. And did I give Clem? Oh, that's three months later, or earlier. So three months went by. So that was out the window. Um. How, How are you doing, there? Clementine? Everything all right? Yeah. Is that man going to be okay? Of course he is. I think he'll, he'll be, be fine. fine. Oh, that's good. Yes, nice. I'm so hungry, Lee. I hope I get to eat soon. You're hungry? So, here's some food. Here, Clem. You need something to eat. Yes, you do. You asked for it, so I'm giving it to you. Okay. A Sunday would be better next time. <laughs> <laughs> I'll keep that in mind. If Cheeky. you have any more food, Duck is hungry too. Yeah, why don't we then get some food? Oh, come on. Keep it. Save last P for someone else. Keep it for me. No, no, no. I'm going to keep it for oh, someone Some else. of these people have gone longer than me without food. They're the ones that need it. Yes, they do. Duck! I'm going to talk to you. If you ask for food. You were pretty I'm brave when we brought it. those people in here. That's because I know Mom can fix him. How you doing, How you doing? Duck? I'm okay. Me and Clementine are coloring. Guess what it is. But, I don't know. A cat. A dog. Nope. Oh, I know. It's a goat, right? No. <laughs> no. Uh, uh, hey, Doc. Get food. How about a little food? <gasps> Here. Yeah. Oh, man, I'm so hungry. Oh, it's a, it's a way to eat a hose. Not such an easy job, That's is it? That's what it is. It's okay. I know you're still watching out for me. Yes, that's fine. I don't envy you. I don't know how you have the strength to do this every day. I don't have a choice. Lee. Kenny, I know I ran out of food before. Hey, it was a tough choice. But you took care of the kids. That's yes, what a did. real man does. I'm serious I'm about that man. offer to come with us. You've more than earned a ride on the RV with me. Still, I guess some people aren't going to be happy with your choices. Yeah, true. Yep. Ken! Lee! Come here, please. He didn't Ken. make it, did he? He lost too much blood. God damn it. I'm getting sick of this shit. Ken, come back. There's nothing... Um... Let him go, Captain. Go. But... He just needs time. It's been a rough morning. That man you brought, I tried. But oh, he man, was he's gonna turn into a zombie. Survive. Well, at least he's not our problem anymore. Possibility. What about the other kid? Oh, come on. Uh, does anything. I don't know what I'm doing, just mashing it. Oh, move, move, move. Oh. 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 You could have stopped me, you idiot. Sitting from the side. You okay? Yeah. Thanks. Why'd you bring him here in the first place, asshole? Dad, calm down. You're oh, gonna on. get us all killed! So what? I'll be well for Why didn't enough. you tell us he was bitten? What? He was bitten, and you didn't say a goddamn word! But he wasn't bitten, I swear! Well, your you not bitten friend us. here came back to life and tried to kill my wife! What? Wait, you all don't know? What the hell are you talking about? 
It's not the bite that does it. Why is it done? You come back no matter how you die. If you don't destroy the brain, that's just what happens. It's gonna happen to all of us. We're all, all infected? Everyone? I... I guess so. I don't know, I... All I know is that I've seen people turn who I know were never bitten. When I first saw it happen, we were all hiding out in a gym okay. and everybody thought we were finally safe. But one of the girls, Jenny Pitcher, I think, I guess she couldn't take it. She took some pills. A lot of them. Damn. Someone went in the girls' room the next morning and... God... Damn, that was Back off! Whoa, lady, relax. Me and my brother, we we just want to know if y'all can help us out. I said back off, Carly. Ooh. We don't, don't want any trouble. Of course, uh, neither do we. Uh, I'm Andy St. John. This here's my brother Dan. We're just out looking for gasoline. Looks like you folks got the motel locked down, which, which is fine, but uh, if you could spare any gas, well, we'd be much obliged. Why do you need gas? Yeah, why? Our place is protected by an electric fence. Generators provide the electricity. Our generators run on gas. Look, we own a dairy farm a few miles up the road. If dairy farm? If y'all be willing to lower your guns, we, we can talk about some kind of trade. How y'all doing on food? We got plenty at the dairy. We must trade. We need food and fuel. Lee, fuel. why don't you and Mark check the place out? See if it's legit. I'm Legit. going with you. Fun. I got your back if anything seems fishy. So, okay. uh, what are y'all thinking? Okay. You've okay. got a deal. We'll bring some gas to your dairy. In exchange, you give us some food to bring back. We'll see how it goes from there. Sounds fair. A couple you gallons should this. power one of our generators for a while. Gallons? Oh, yeah. Well, about 100 meters, but that's So, good. this dairy, you guys really have food? Sure do. We lost most of the cattle, but we still have lots of milk, butter, and cheese stocked up. Yeah, and with dry, the vegetables we grow, we got plenty of food. That's got to be freaky. It's nice it's to get away from that evil. motel for a while. This Lily Kenny thing is starting to get ridiculous. Personally, I'd be happier if you started to take charge more. Me as leader? Yes. You think they'd want me for a leader? Sure, everybody looks up to you. If well, his mind or mine, everyone mind thinks I'm so trustworthy. We are because of your past. Does anyone else know? Um, I think you. Larry knows. Great, that can't be easy. Clementine might know. She was there when we were talking in the drugstore. Asked oh. me about it. I lied to her, but. What exactly did happen with the senator? It was an accident. I mean, I, I pretty much knew about the affair. Sometimes I wonder if I should talk to the group about it. You don't have to. Whatever happened before things went to hell doesn't matter anymore. Not sure everyone would see it that way. Maybe you're right. Listen, over the years I've reported on some pretty messed up shit. I've seen Damn. situations like yours a hundred times. It doesn't have <laughs> to make you a bad man. So I mad uh, people really appreciate makes, that. makes you not a bad man. I mean, thank God Lee showed up yeah. when he did. Right, Lee? Yeah, why don't you tell us a little more about yourself, Lee? Where are you from? Whoa, what's with all the purple? Okay. I grew up in Macon. Right here Macon. in the heart of Georgia. That's what I like to hear. Y'all seem pretty settled in at that motor inn. Uh, who's running things over there? Um, Lee Ken is a Demux and... Yeah, we work that as one. a group. All of us looking out for each other. I hear oh, that's that. What it means. There's so many dumbasses out there fighting each other these days. It's just stupid. How many people you got over there anyway? Uh, don't know. Enough, Enough to, defend, to defend ourselves. Well, that's good. It's getting dangerous out there. Well, I can't, you guys know. Can't name them all. Well, we'd love to get you all out to the dairy. Like I said, we got plenty of food, and quite frankly, we could always use an extra helping hand. In the summers, I used to help out on a goat farm. Yeah, that's great. Everything helps. Mama's been running a dairy for goat as long as I can remember. But, uh, now it's. But you think you're going to cut me out of this? Ooh, ooh, ooh. Shh, get down. No 
one's trying to cut you out of anything. You and Gary are always Fuck pulling this shit. Bandits. Who? Those look like the people who oh, raided man, my camp. Who are they? Kill them. Fuck you. Fuck you knew we were hungry. And are. you guys were keeping it You're all to yourself. Oh no. There's Hi. you know what? Yo, look at that. Hello. What are you gonna fucking That's do you, the cross Don't worry. Eddie, out. I got you covered if something no. happens. But let's just wait this no, out. I hope they move on. Fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck you! Jesus! You're wasting bullets. Hey, you guys crossbow. The world out here has gone to shit. Come on, let's get to the dairy where it's safe. I mean, you didn't pick up the crossbow, but the crossbow's gone. Now I'm on the crossbow. You nice type of the crossbow. Here it is, St. John Family Dairy. Ooh, that looks normal. <laughs> Y'all can see how we kept this place so safe. The fence keeps them out? <laughs> you betcha. They fry like bugs in a zapper. <laughs> We're pushing 4,000 volts through that thing. That. Generators and amps. I'm going to assume that's a lot. It's possibly is. We've got kids in our group. Doesn't seem safe to have them near a lethal fence. Oh, don't worry about that. We got plenty to keep them entertained. This place Ooh. looks untouched. I you never what. know the rest of the world is in ruins. It's worth protecting. Hence all the juice. Yes, it is. I thought I saw y'all with company coming down the drive. Guys, this is our mama. I'm Brenda St. John, and welcome to the St. John, John Dairy. This here's Lee. He's from Macon. A couple of our old farm hands were from Macon. They grow them good there. Well, just bacon. They got a few more friends staying at the old motel. Oh my goodness, that place is pretty vulnerable. Have you got someone yeah. with survival experience to lead your group? Nope. But we all together, work together. Plus, we've got plenty of people with military experience. Well, that's good Ooh, to military. hear. That motel ain't the safest place. Now that y'all are here, we'll make sure you're safe and comfortable. Yay. Thanks for having us. We brought some gasoline on oh, good no. faith. Is this second We're all actually? incredibly hungry. Would These are for y'all. Baked fresh this morning. Amazing. Mm. Can't get stuff like that anymore. Not without a cow for milk and butter, that's for sure. That's right. Mm. Hopefully Maybelle will make it through this bout of whatever she's got and be with us for a good long while. Your cow is sick? No. But she... We have a vet. We could bring her here. We can help you folks out. A vet? Oh my! Our prayers have been answered! Maybe our whole group could come for the day. I mean, well, how about this? Y'all go get your veterinary friend and I'll prepare some dinner. A big feast for all you hungry souls. Yay. It'll be nice to have some folks to help out around here again. Danny, why don't you, don't Danny, why don't you come much help food. me out in the kitchen? Well, I'm just gonna food. It's gonna be nice. Why don't I head back with the food and round up everyone for the trip over here? Might want to take someone with you. Remember, those roads can be dangerous. I can yep. handle myself. Take this. Why don't you go ahead and take Ben along anyway? Take care of yourself, Lee. See you in a while. Bye. Mark, Lee, why don't you take a look around? Once we'll you get settled that. in, I could use some help securing the perimeter. Is there a yep. problem? Sometimes the dead get tangled up in the fence before they fry and end up knocking <laughs> over a post. It'd be yeah. a big help if you could walk the perimeter. You Guess can learn a little should. something about our fence. I'm gonna go top off the generators before they run dry. Come get me when you're ready. You we'll betcha. Do. This place is incredible. It's got food. And that fence? Oh man, that fence. If we play Damn, our cards right, fence. this might turn out to be a place we can stay. Yeah, so how do you this time, should we help out? Let's so before yes. we can think about bringing our whole group here to stay, we need to figure out if this place is as safe as they're telling us. Right, that's my obviously that's they that. think it's safe, but is it safe enough for the kids? I noticed a broken swing over there. Not a big deal, but maybe there's other things not working that we just can't see yet. And checking the fence perimeter sounds like a decent way to get a good look at their defenses. Yes, it is. All right, 
I'll keep my eyes open, and you find out what you can from Andy. Yep. So there we are. Walking away. So yeah, thank you for watching. I hope you liked it. And yeah, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. And yeah. Yeah, thanks for watching. And to all.